Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to mount this uh, Dyson handheld vacuum cleaner on the wall. So all Dysons they come with this kind of uh, mounts. The way it works is you simply pull it like this and uh, put it on the wall. So what you have to do first, you have to find the proper location and choose uh, the desired height. So uh, this is where approximately we decided to put it and uh, also you have to make sure there is an electrical outlet not far and so the cord can reach the base. So after you chose the spot uh, using the level make sure that everything is square make uh, markings where you're gonna put the screw in uh, because we're mounting our Dyson into drywall I will be using this kind of drywall anchor uh, the way it works is uh, you just put the screw that comes with the anchor slide it all the way in and uh, what happens when it reaches uh, the end is uh, this part here will move back and it will hold the drywall providing like a pretty decent holding power I was thinking about this kind of anchor first but I'm afraid I'm afraid that it won't be strong enough because you have to because you are putting uh, Dyson back in, then taking it off, so you need a little bit more holding power than that. Before you start drilling the wall or putting anything into the wall, uh, I suggest that you should actually check uh, using this start, start sensor. What it also does is uh, shows if there are any wires uh, behind the wall, electrical wires. So. I strongly suggest that this should be done so you can see that in this area so there's no signal this means that there is nothing behind in this area like in comparison I'll show you for example in this area we do have a stud that's running through here but unfortunately in our case the door is in the back and it doesn't allow us to mount the vacuum in that area so um, what I'm gonna do now is uh, I'm gonna actually do two pilot holes even though that on the website of this anchor it says that you don't have to do a pilot hole that this piece is precise you just have to screw it in I will do it anyway and uh, I believe that it will provide us a better accuracy in the end. Also do is uh, well the hole is not big enough. I'll just make it a little bit bigger. Uh, because this bolt is pretty long, I want to make sure that it goes in all the way. Because if it doesn't, this won't work properly. So once you have checked all that, you can now pull in the anchor. Good. 
same with the bottom one. Alright, so after we've put in the anchors, what I'm going to do is uh, you have to install the charging cable into the mount by just simply pushing it inside. that put the wire in here Just keep, keep screwing it in until, remember what I said, that's when that piece turns and uh, starts holding the wall. So because this amount actually gives you a little bit of room to adjust it, so you can have it level. That's what I'm gonna do again. almost ready don't over tighten it either because it's still drywall and you can damage it well let's see how we did uh, all right guys uh, thank you for watching I hope this was helpful if you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments and I'll see you in the next video.